Reintroducing the Make Noise Quad Multimode Gate. The QMMG is returning in a strictly limited black and gold edition to be sold at Make Noise headquarters in Asheville, North Carolina during the Make Noise 10 year celebration weekend. For information and tickets to this event, see the video description. The reissue QMMG's signal path is identical to the original. The top board was re-engineered to use analog pots for mode selection instead of analog switches. The only change to the bottom board is the addition of reverse power protection. Each channel of the QMMG can be set to act as a VCA, low pass gate, low pass filter, or high pass filter. The channels have independent outputs and there is a sum out for mixing. As with the sum out on maths, use of a channel's individual output removes it from the sum. In fact, the maths was originally designed to be a patch buddy for the QMMG, and we highly recommend a pairing of the two. Each channel has the same set of controls, but probably not the same sound, since the QMMG is a vactral based device, and the character of vactral elements varies quite a bit from unit to unit. The control offset acts as amplitude and or frequency control depending on mode. It is of course voltage controllable. Feedback control has different functionality depending on the mode setting. In both mode, which is the mode most people recognize as low pass gate, it damps the ringing of the LPG circuit, making the amplitude envelope modulation tighter and shorter. In VCA mode, it can subtly increase the overall gain. In low pass and high pass modes, feedback provides a voltage controlled resonance. The inner channels of the QMMG have their inputs normal to the outputs of the outer channels for easy serial patching. For example, patch a signal to channel 1 and its output will be routed through channel 2 automatically unless you patch something else to channel 2's input. Potential configurations are many. Set channel 1 to low pass and channel 2 to BCA and monitor channel 2 output for a classic synth voice.
change channel 2 to high pass for a dual peak band pass filter. The control inputs of the channel pair are also normal together, so for example we can modulate this bandpass filter's cutoff frequencies at once by simply patching our control channel to channel 1's control input. For independent control, just add modulation to channel 2. Note that if we monitor the sum out in this configuration, we'll hear the two channel outputs mixed together, with a different sound from the bandpass. Consider the QMMG a multi tap filter network.